welcome back to another video. If you don't know who I am, my name is Lainey and I try to post videos twice a week and on this channel you can find anything from Lolita fashion to alternative fashion to cosplay. I also tend to do a lot of skits, CMV, special effects videos, so it's a lot of fun. Please join our family and hit that notification button. I also have a TikTok and an Instagram that I post on daily if you would like to further support me, but it is never necessary. Anyways, today we have an unboxing slash review video. So I was cursed, as I've seen some people call it in the Lolita community, with hobbit feet. It is extremely hard for me to find shoes and unfortunately I don't fit into bodyline shoes or angelic pretty shoes or baby shoes, so I end up having to get off-brand shoes and the I've only found three different places that sell shoes in my size, which are Antania, uh, Cotton Candy Feet and Honey Cherry and the shoes I reviewed last time, which I don't even know what brand those were. So today we're going to be reviewing some Honey Cherry Tea Parties. They're in lavender and I've been hearing a lot about Honey Cherry. They are a legitimate AliExpress reseller, so they are very attainable and they're also really cheap. I think these were $23 with shipping. Uh, speaking of shipping, I did have a little bit of an issue where it said it was delivered, but it wasn't delivered and then I kind of panicked because I wasn't home on the day it said it was delivered and I messaged the seller and was like, what is going on? Did this get stolen? And the seller was like, nah man, just, just call USPS. And then it showed up like the next day. So <laughs> that gave me a slight heart attack because I, I was so panicked. I cannot stand when something says it's delivered and then it's not here because like I automatically think it's stolen and I think I'm out that money and I like have to allocate my money very smart, which I have a hard time doing, but anyways, let's get into it. These took about a month to get here, almost a month to the dot. Oh my god, I hate shoe smell. You open it and it's just like this burst of like gross toxic plastic. It's like the same smell from when I unboxed my uh, Yolanda Bunny Herbology dress, like that bad of a smell. If you do get a package, be sure to just leave it there for a couple days at a minimum so you can kill off anything that's on it. And it's just an extra precaution to take during the pandemic. So here we got the shoes. They are very much bubble wrapped. That is so much bubble wrap, but I actually really appreciate that. I, I'm gonna grab scissors. Scissors, let's go. Oh, this is very hard to do on camera. Oh, I didn't mean to tear the actual bubble wrap, but that's okay. Uh, so these guys are wrapped in a tissue paper to protect them. So unwrapping them. Oh, these are gorgeous. Oh wow, I was not expecting them to be this pretty of a lavender color actually. They're literally exactly like the pink ones I ordered but my pink ones are like hot pink and these are like a soft lavender. It's not a deep enough lavender to match my True Doll JSK that I'm wearing right now, but it's close enough to be honest. Uh, anyways, these are in a size 42. I sized up to a 10 and it comes with one of these detachable ankle holders, I guess you could say. All of the buckles are made out of metal and they are little hearts. It's made out of this fake leather in general, and there's this little heart on the heel too. Not the heel, but like where your heel goes, and it just gives it a little bit of extra squish. The sole itself is actually very squishy. It has this cute like polka dot pattern, and there's a little bit of like suede on the heel. It looks very well made. The one issue is that part of the heel is coming back off on the bottom, and this is the right shoe. But these ankle things are detachable, and these little heart straps are also adjustable. My issue with the first pair of shoes I got, they weren't from Honey Cherry, but they're probably from the same distributor, is that like this was just too big that it didn't do anything, these straps. So I need to figure out how to punch holes in it. But this is such a gorgeous color. I haven't really been using these ankle straps on my other ones because I just find them to be a hassle. So I'm just gonna take them off really fast and throw on this shoe because I am very time constrained right now. But you can remove these ankle things, which is really cool. And we're gonna slip on the shoe. Oh, these fit perfect, holy crap. My other ones were like a little bit on the bigger side, but these are perfect. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. 
These are literally the same exact size as the other ones, but these just fit better. But they're probably from the same distributor. Whatever. Okay. I'm not going to question it. I'm not complaining. Now for the left shoe, which if you watch my other shoe review from a different company, you'll know that they weren't really symmetric. They were pretty symmetric, but not perfectly symmetric. Oh, these are... Oh, there's a free gift in this one! Oh, honey cherry! This is so cute! They gave me just a thing of stickers, and they're like little transformer cars. Oh, how did you know I love stickers? Anyways, uh, for the sole on this one, it's coming off a little bit on the edge and in the same place as the right shoe, but I think these are pretty symmetric. These are actually super symmetric, like the bow shape and size look a lot more symmetric than my pink pair of shoes, and the bows on the back also look very similar. But this is constructed the same, and they are super, super cute. So I'm gonna slip them on my feet, and I'll prance around a little bit, and I'll just tell you how they feel. So I have two minutes to finish this video, and uh, we can do it. Once again, I'm taking off the little ankle straps, because I personally just don't like those. For a meet, I'll probably put them on if I'm walking around a lot, but for just taking pictures and making TikToks, it's not really too much of a hassle. I'm too lazy for that. Like, I struggled getting into this outfit, and it's like literally a JSK and a shirt, and that's it. Like, there aren't a lot of pieces. Oh, these are really comfortable. There's like a little bit of squish in the heel, which is really nice. And my feet aren't moving around. And you know how I was talking about how they're on my pink shoes, there's like a lot of space above the straps. Like, the straps were too big. I'm not having that issue with these. Like, these are the perfect length right now, and I can even go smaller. These are comfortable. I would wear these everywhere. Okay, I'm definitely ordering more Honey Cherry shoes in like every color they have, but uh, but I'm getting kicked out. Okay, one second. Uh, anyways, thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for my next video and be sure to hit that subscribe button for more videos twice a week. And I also post on Instagram and TikTok. I post a lot of Lolita TikToks constantly, so go check those out. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.